In this section, we will learn how to make the pairwise comparisons when introducing subcriteria into our model. I have here the model that I made in the previous section. I've gone ahead and made all the pairwise comparisons the same as they were in the previous sections, except of course the ones I've just introduced. So I want to make a pairwise comparison between acquisition cost and maintenance cost, which are subcriteria of cost. So I'll go to cost and go to node comparison interface. And so here I have one pairwise comparison. Now that's because there's only two choices. If there are more than two, then I'd have more than one comparison to make. So let's say I think that maintenance cost is strongly more important than acquisition cost. So I click five. If you look over here to the right, you'll notice that the inconsistency is zero. That's because there's only two choices. If there was more than two, we'd have to keep an eye on that inconsistency level and make sure it was under 0.1. Now I have to compare each of the alternatives with respect to acquisition cost and maintenance cost. So let's start with acquisition cost. Now remember, these are kind of just made up examples because I don't really know what car one, car two, and car three are, so I'm just kind of, kind of make them up. Let's say eight, five, and four. And then let's say for maintenance cost, let's say seven, five, and three. Okay, so now I have the rating scales with respect to each of the alternatives, and I can go ahead and synthesize the model like I did before. And there you go. So even with the subcriteria factored in, CAR2 is the most preferable option out of the three.